With patch pumps more popular than ever, Tandem is working on joining the race with this little beauty. This is the T-Sport. Hello, it's Camille, Nerdabetic, your diabetes tech guy, and in today's video, I am going to be breaking down the entire future pipeline from Tandem, from phone control to their brand new insulin pump, the T-Sport. If you want more videos about diabetes tech, make sure you subscribe and have the notifications turned on to never miss out a future video about diabetes tech. So let's go in a chronological order of this pipeline, and the very first thing on the pipeline is a lovely update to the current display app with full phone control. So this update will allow full phone control of your T-Slim X to insulin pump, including bolusin from your phone. Now, we are so close from having this launched, in fact, Tandem has already done all of the work and already submitted an update to their app to the American FDA and we are just waiting for FDA's approval before it's launched. We expect an international rollout later in 2021. Full phone control in first half of 2021 is really the foundation of the second item on Tandem's pipeline, which is perhaps the most exciting part of their entire pipeline which is the launch of hugely exciting T-Sport patch pump from Tandem. Patch insulin pump is really the combination of a tube pump and a pod pump, so it's somewhere in between and it usually has a short tube. Patch is not a new concept, we have multiple pumps uh, that are in the patch category, so to name one we have the Kaleido patch pump, a very colourful patch pump, and we have the AcuCheck Solo from Roche Diabetes Care, and the T-Sport from Tandem is somewhere in the middle of both of those. So let's talk about T-Sport and all of its features. So first of all, as you can see, uh, there is uh, the main black hardware component, which is rechargeable. And that is the main difference between something like an Omnipod and a patch pump. Patch pump always has an element which is reusable, which is the main environmental point of having a patch pump. So it's unlike with the Omnipod where you just throw the entire thing away, you actually reuse this bit, which is the same um, concept as with the Kaleido patch pump. So the Kaleido patch pump, you also recharge the main body of the pump and you just change the insulin reservoir and the infusion set. And the same process will apply to the T-Spot insulin pump where you just change the infusion set and the reservoir. T-Spot will hold 200 units of insulin and it has a great little feature which is at the bottom here and that is this button right here. That is the bolus button. T-Sport insulin pump will actually allow you to bolus without your phone on the pump itself just by pressing this little button. And that is a very similar feature to what we have on the Roche's AcuCheck Solo. So in the AcuCheck Solo you have two buttons on the side and you have to press them simultaneously to activate the bolus mode and then each press gives you an increment of insulin and you can customize this in the settings. So for most users, it's uh, 0.2 uh, units. So five presses would result in one unit of insulin. I've actually got a clip uh, showing you how this is working. So I press and hold. That was the sign I can now program and I go one, two, three, four, five, now I wait. Was it five? Yeah. Okay, I press one more time. And this D, 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 that tells me now the balls actually starts running. I love this. And since the pump delivers with two units per minute, I have to talk now for 30 seconds. And the insulin is now in your body. Yes, yeah, so a melody indicates that a bolus has been delivered on the solo pump. And you know what I call that? Sweet melody. That's a joke to all of you Little Mix fans out there. Listen to it on Apple Music, it's, it's delightful. Of course, this button is not the only way to bolus. 
The entire pump will be controlled with the T-Connect app that I've been talking about at the very beginning of this video uh, and it will have full phone control just like the current T-Slim X2 insulin pump. T-Sport is also predicted to be launched with a dedicated controller in case you do not want to use the app on your phone to control your T-Sport, you'll be able to use a, a dedicated controller as well. And of course, T-Sport will launch with Control IQ built in, so we'll be able to use uh, the Control IQ algorithm that we currently have on the T-Slim X2 insulin pump on the T-Sport with Dexcom G6, and by that time, uh, maybe even Dexcom G7. Well, What's next on Tandem's pipeline after the launch of T-Sport patch pump, you may ask? Well, we do know that Tandem is working on some exciting enhancements and updates to the Control IQ algorithm. Tandem has been very secretive about what they are working on, but they have told us that they are working on improving time and range and customer experiences. So, my personal prediction is that we are going to see first of all improved algorithm altogether because they have a lot real world data to actually improve the algorithm itself as a and b that we are going to see more uh, modes more activities as they like to call them so at the moment we have sleep and exercise now i'm predicting that there was actually further diversify the exercise mode into, wait for it, cardio exercise and strength exercise because they just launched the T-Sport engine pump. <laughs> As my prediction, I think that's what they're going to do. Hashtag strength, hashtag pulsing, hitting the gym, hashtag games. But if they don't do that, I'm sure they will launch just more modes to further customize the algorithm. And so that's Tandem's pipeline from full phone control in first half of 2021 to the very exciting launch of the T Sport, which is predicted in second half of 2021, to updates to the control IQ algorithm and improved experiences. So I'm all here for it. I can't wait. I'm honestly, I can't be can tell. I'm so excited about the T-Sport pump. Um, yeah, it, when it hits the UK, I, yeah, I will, it, it will definitely be the one that I'm like, yeah, might be the time. Um, especially with the improved control IQ algorithm. So, I can't wait. I, I literally can't wait. So, please let me know what you think about the T-Sport. Are you excited for it? Uh, and if you are currently using uh, the TCM X2 engine pump of Control IQ, please let me know. Are you excited about all of uh, the new features, including full phone control? Um, that's going to be huge for, I know, um, many users. So let me know in the comments. I'm, I'm, I can't wait to hear from you. And so that's that. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great time. Um, have a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And I will see you with some super exciting stuff in 2021. Until then, take care, stay safe, and I see you there. Bye!